the actions by the cadets are symptoms of a greater problem. Delegate Jennifer Carol Foy, one of VMI's first black female graduates, responding to reports of lynching threats and racist social media attacks towards black cadets at VMI. Tonight, the Institute writes to Governor Northam that the incidents, quote, had more to do with an individual's lapse of judgment than they do with the culture of the Institute. So to be honest with you, my experiences at Virginia Military Institute being one of the first women and black women to ever graduate uh, from VMI, it's it was a lot more egregious in some of the accounts that were written. Carol Foy did not want to describe in detail what she faced, but she did talk about persevering. Delegate, can you illustrate what it's like to have these things happen to you? VMI's motto is basically um, to break you down to build you back up. While I knew that, I can tell you that I was able to endure. VMI has one of the highest dropout rates in the country, and that's not by accident, it's by design. But some of the things should not be tolerated. VMI has a strict honor code with one single case of cheating leading to expulsion. Carol Foy wants racist behavior punished the same way. You are immediately expelled, dismissed, um, disgraced from the Institute. And so we need to elevate other instances to that same type of single sanction penalties. Mike Valerio, WUSA 9.